Elizabeth Nix joins us today with all the details on Music Camp coming up at First United Methodist Church. Elizabeth, thanks for joining us today. Great to see you again. Of Thank course, you. Of course, of course. And what a unique, different camp that we have out here for yes. the summer. Tell us about it. Well, this camp would have changed my life as a kid, as a musician. And so it's for any kids who are interested in music. And even if they're not sure if they're interested, when you understand something better, you can love it. And so we're just trying to foster this appreciation. And uh, this is our second year doing it. So we learned a lot from last year. Um, it's super unique. So we're gonna teach the kids basic fundamentals about uh, rhythm and sound. They'll get to try a wide variety of instruments from the accordion to the tuba to the, p we do group piano class and uh, drum circles. And then um, we're even gonna teach them how to move their body when they hear a certain genre, like what instrument to lock into. And that is so useful in Louisiana. I grew up in Lafayette. <laughs> I attended so many events where there was just a random band and knowing how to move, I would have had so much more confidence just participating in our culture. And then my favorite part from last year was at the end of each day we have a live band and the kids can ask them questions and you know I've known some of these musicians for 20 years so seeing them these are people who perform for a living seeing them put on their teacher hat and share their passion it was just it was so inspirational I'm so excited to be doing it again um, and then we're gonna close out the four-day camp with steel drums by our church pool which is just perfect with this heat um, just to kind of celebrate everything we learned. Absolutely. It's such a, an incredible and unique uh, camp as it well. It really is. So tell me about the age range here. Um, this year we're doing kids who are going into first grade, so okay. they need to have completed kindergarten all the way through high school. We're hoping we have enough kids sign up that we can separate them into two groups and really like meet the age appropriately. That's fantastic. Yes. And so not only that, but the first 50 people who sign up are free. Yes, that's wow. the coolest part. That's because, huge. Uh, last year we charged thirty-five dollars, and once we saw just the potential it had, the church added it to its budget so that the first fifty kids could join for free. Wow! And then after that, it's thirty-five dollars, which is, I think, still a good deal it is. for what they're getting. <laughs> it's such a cool experience. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. And so you still have spots left. We still have free spots left. Okay. Um, you know, it's it's getting closer to fifty, so we're super excited to just have it full. That's fantastic. Yes. And so if someone's interested in signing up for this camp, mm -hmm. what's the best way to do that? You can sign up on our website. It's www.fumca.org. And uh, you just fill out a few things and uh, plug in your shirt size. And um, all participants get this cool shirt. These are actually some of the clinicians that will be uh, participating in our camp. We had them animated by an artist. <laughs> um, so that just kind of adds to the memory of it that it's actually musicians that they'll get to work with. So, Very cool. Now, which musicians are on the shirt and who are actually coming to the camp? Um, so this year we have Modern Jazz Movement coming. Um, that's a, a quartet. That's They've been playing together for forever. I don't really? Even, at least 20 years. Um, I used to listen to them when I was in college. Wow. And then we have uh, Poisson Rouge. They're a Zydeco band with a female singer who like raps while she plays accordion. Oh, it's so cool. cool. <laughs> so, it was so weird. Um, and unique and then we have um, new natives brass band which is like funk so cool that is awesome yeah so the kids are gonna get to see lots of different genres of All music All kinds of things and then one day we're gonna have an opera singer and a rock singer Wow so they can like right one really kind of to the other yeah <laughs> like and really like ask them both questions yeah so cool. absolutely yeah. well it just sounds like a great experience tell us again the dates for the camp the hours that for the camp and then how we can register. Okay, it's going to be July 11th to 13th. That's Monday through Thursday. You can drop off the kids at 12:30, so on your lunch break and um, the camp goes 1 to 5, so you can pick them up after work. Super easy to sign up. You just go to our website. It's www.fumca.org and uh, you can fill out the form and sign them up. 
Fantastic. Well, Elizabeth, thank you so much for joining us and telling us about this great opportunity for kids in the area. We appreciate it so much. Thanks for having me. Thank you. Of course, and we'll be right back with more Good Day Sin Law right after this break.